Hi there. Uh, so, uh, a friend of mine asked about glass uh, and how to produce a, a sort of glassy effect, uh, which also looks as if it's refracting the light. Um, so, I'm going to do a quick tutorial here now. The layer that I, the layer style even that I use for my glass layer um, is quite complex. There's a lot of different settings, so it would be it would take a bit too long to go through on here. So instead, when you downloaded this video, you should find that there is a styles, uh, sorry, an ASL file inside, and you can import that um, into Photoshop and then uh, use it on the layer. So just in case you don't know. Um, if I just make a new layer here, if you want to import a layer style, you go to layer, down to layer style and blending options, and then click on styles right at the top just here. And then there's a little arrow here, and you can click that, and then just choose load styles, and load the file that's included with this video. So, now, I'm going to take a uh, rounded rectangle, I'm just going to draw it here. It's also important to make sure it's white. Uh, so now I've got that, I'm just going to apply the layer style to it. So I'll go down to layer style and blending options. Styles and then on to glass, which I think is this one here. Yep, there we go. Okay, right, so there's our glass layer. Just click off that. Yep, so there it is. Now. As it is, um, you know, it's not reflecting, refracting any light at all. So we'll change that by uh, pressing the control key and then clicking on our shape layer. Now on Windows, uh, I believe the key is control, but it may be out. I'm not 100%, so, uh, but it should be one of uh, those two keys. So once we've got that selected, we can just go down to our background, go to filter, Blur and Gaussian Blur, and in this case, I've got four pixels, but I think I might increase that a little bit. Right, so there we go. So now, as you can see, it's sort of blurring in the background, and then we'll just deselect that, and uh, there we've got some glass. Um, I probably could have done uh, a bit more work on this one, and it's something that you have to play around with to get a truly realistic effect. Um, but that's just a quick way of doing it, um, and having the layer style for the glass certainly makes it very quick to do. Uh, I hope you found this very helpful, uh, and if you have any comments or feedback, then please leave a comment or email me using the contact form on my website. Thanks. Bye.